So now you have a whole bunch of LinkedIn invitations in your target tab. And some of those invitations have been accepted into your new acceptances tab. Now we're going to move them across to the sales tracking tab. Now, once you use the send acceptance message, uh, it will automatically move this person into sales tracking. I'm going to do it manually now just to show you. So I'm going to take Andrew Springgate, pretend I've just clicked on the send acceptance message and I click that button down arrow to move him to the sales tracking tab. Now, Andrew is in my sales tracking tab. I can also move him down again into the hot leads tab. This might be called custom tab. You can rename this tab simply by just typing in whatever you want to type in. Just leave it for now as hot leads. So now Andrew's in the hot leads. I'm going to move him back into sales tracking. Sales tracking is where your leads go, but your really hot leads that you're working on will obviously go into your hot leads section. Now that you've moved them into sales tracking and the same goes with hot leads, you can now do a couple of really cool things, including using this button once again to send a custom message or a handover message. Now remember, your invitation message goes out to invite people. Your acceptance message goes out to thank them for the invitation. Your custom information, a custom message goes out with some custom information on what you want to send to them that's over and above some great content, etc. And then finally, your handover message, which is essentially hands them over, which we'll talk about in more detail in a later tutorial. Let's say I want to send Andrew Springbait, Springgate a custom message. I click on the word custom message. It'll automatically generate this message. Hi, Andrew. I think you'll love my new video on how to leave effective LinkedIn voice messages. Here it is here. Once again, remember this little button here allows you to create a tracking link. This is hugely important. And I'll explain to that in a lot more detail later. But for now, I just want to quickly show you what happens when you do this. Once you've moved people across and you've started interacting with them, these little tags are going to start appearing. And you can start creating these tags as well. Some of them will be automated once you send messages and some of them you can create yourself. I'll talk about tags later, but in the meantime, use this button to start sending out your quick message templates within seconds to each of these connections that you now have.